This is a part of the series or of VLOST <laughs> where I try to go over our mistakes and yeah, let's see what's happening in this one. Oh shit, the fly is dead now. Okay, Speeding, speeding up a bit. Okay, I'm gonna slow a bit. So uh, usually against RMP, uh, I try to Riptide, Healing Rain, and Ghost Wolf, and not Healing Tide, uh, Healing Stream Totem, and Ghost Wolf like pre opener. Uh, I Ghost Wolf here, but he's not gonna open me because the Warlock is so far away, so he's gonna opener the. I'm gonna get sap. I don't know. This was so weird. Um, the warrior went in like he went in. I was so far away. I was expecting a hard start on me. I don't know why. Why? Why we are pushing in? Uh, from this start, I mean, from the start, I don't think this is how we should play it. Because if I have to go mid. Like, I have to cross that map to heal the warrior, right? Uh, I would just get fucking raped. Like, the rogue would just swap on me, triple stun me, and the warlock would free cast with his wall up or some shit. And, uh, what the fuck would I be able to do? Nothing, I'll just die, right? Because I'm, uh, I'm the squishier target in here, I think. And maybe worries as well. So I'm still sad, where it's like still going ham over there. He doesn't really care, he's just going in. I still cannot heal, still cannot heal. Okay, I just got the shield on him. And I'm I'm scared. I'm like they I know where RLS, I used to play RLS. They they kill shamans, they kill healers like real easily. I still cannot heal the warrior. He sh he still goes in and I get rooted here. I try to cast I got blinded on that shit. I like trinket and uh, trinket blind dispel after a heal. And he's still like small bomb now. Please leap away after that stun. I have nothing. I cannot do shit. I could maybe link, but still wouldn't be enough. I actually ground hex over there, and I sheer sh I sheer uh, fear. And uh, I'm not sure if I sheer fear actually, but whatever. I sheared some warlock cast. Yes, that's for sure. Uh, he also used die by the dog. I get spell lock. Feels bad, man. I'm gonna drop on uh, sky fury maybe. Yes, I do. And gonna go for another cast and got cheap shot. Fuck my life. And this is like rogue cooldowns. And I think warrior should have went rogue right here and maybe stop some shit. Got kicked again, so this doesn't matter. Now the warrior is coming like way too late. He actually leaps on the shaman. I think I'm gonna root the rogue over here. Yeah, I do. Okay, so the warrior did nothing for the past like. 5 seconds, but in the opener he just went in and now he's not going in when he was kinda safe and now he's getting fucked up again I got interrupted for 1 second wow, amazing, dispelled it that's why I play calming by the way uh, this is a good tip if you didn't know if you get sheared, interrupted, whatever besides the you know, interrupting interrupted the interrupting ability being you know a lower lockout you can also you also get uh, short duration silences which is very good for UA uh, before the grounding change where you could have dispelled and ground grounded the UA silence now you cannot do that anymore this is like the way to go like play calming you miss on healing that's for sure because you won't have the haste or the vim and vigor but usually the haste uh, but overall I think it's pretty good against two afflictions and this was on the patch where uh, affliction was doing a lot of damage okay let's move on so that the unstable dispel was pretty you know he did he did nothing only damage but the silence didn't it was like one second so whatever okay so n now it's the right time to push in okay I'm, I'm going I'm going yeah I'm right here I get rooted I see the rogue coming towards me or the boomkin I guess he's going boomkin I kinda want to swap or she got the yard stun into clone okay 
I'm gonna still keep Urshield on the warrior since he's the, he's the one who is getting pushed in. He who pushes in and pretty much gets swapped all the time. Now I get swapped by the rogue again. I was trying to dispel the warrior, but I guess I went into line with the warlock, which was bad. I got stunned over here. I have no trinket, and I f I go down. I mean, I guess this was pretty fucked. Ah, uh, this is so so annoying. Like. I I can't really heal the warrior. I can't even heal myself because of the stuns. And I don't know. It seemed like we had more pressure, but they easily recovered. And then I I'm pretty pushed in, so it's easy to both of them to hit me. I went to the edge over there, so that's my big mistake. I thought I was fine because the it was it was only shadow dance, but I'm I wasn't really. Um, accustomed to the rogue damage in this uh, new patch when I played this so the rogue pretty much soloed me the warlock got casts off I, st I did have dots on me that's that's for sure but he got like one UA when I was, was already like 10% so I would have died regardless probably or maybe or maybe I could have gotten the link off but yeah um, yeah this was my my bad for sure I could have stayed back way more but I think even if I stay back uh, they should come to us I mean they should be in the open they should be uh, in the bad position and I should like try to play it safe because we have more boards they have more rot so uh, if we are in the open the warlock is free to rot everybody so we'll, we'll for sure get fucked and if they go on us the warlock will have a harder time to actually get dots off. So yeah, my my bad was uh, trying to push in when we had some sort of pressure. I should have just stayed back and uh, max range the rogue and actually maybe root him when he tries to swap me and just I don't know, just leave the warrior to die or stuff like that. He probably wouldn't die because he's really tanky as well. But yeah, the DR stun on the rogue wasn't good. The Stormbolt DR, so they double DR stuns on the on the rogue, which was pretty awkward as well. And uh, yeah, feels bad, man. Hope you like this one. So remember, guys, position matters a lot. Uh, try to be on Skype with your partners if you can. I can't really most of the time. Uh, and like yell to that warrior, yo, come back, come back. We need them to push in. Stuff like that, you know. Another thing, if they get a good opener, we're probably be we're gonna probably get fucked uh, as well. But you know, maybe not. Anyway, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoy this one and uh, leave a comment if you did and. If you like this or have a suggestion of what I could have done better in this uh, game, uh, yeah, please leave a comment and uh, express your opinion. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. See you next time. Bye.